Right, this is where Richard III was found, and there's a new bit that's covering the um, the spot just behind that wall there, where Richard III was actually discovered there. It's pouring with rain. This is a private car park, Greyfriars Car Park. This is where the excavation took part place. This is where the priory was in the past. Greyfriars. And I've been inside um, today. It's raining all day today in Leicester. And um, this is where they found him, in this car park. I'm just doing a very quick video. And so there we are, there we've got the Greyfriars car park there. And there we have the building which houses um, lots of information about Richard III and everything in there now. The centre. There was a school once, I believe. It's weird, isn't it? They just found him in the car park. It's pouring, it's an awful day. Absolutely awful. There's the there's the um the car park. There's this little car park. Look. And he was here for four or five hundred years. I went in there earlier. In there. I've been in there. And they have like an image of his skeleton that, uh, that comes up when you're in there, like a hologram type thing. Yeah, it's a shame. It's really bad weather. But I've done the cathedral. I've seen the tomb. And um, I've got a ticket. We can go back for up to a year. There's the church. The cathedral, I should say. There. And this is the, the place where um, Richard III was found, everyone. I've done, vi I've done video, um, lots and lots of photos. Here we are, look, Greyfriar, Richard III's Medieval Leicester, Greyfriars Friary. This panel marks the location of the former Greyfriars Friar complex. <sighs> All that remains is a small piece of grey stone wall. There we are, look. Of course, I've seen it all on telly. It's all been videoed. <sighs> Following his death at the Battle of Bosworth in August 1485, King Richard's naked corpse was brought back to Leicester, slung over a horse. His body was immediately upon public display to prove he was dead. It was the Franciscan Friars of Leicester who then took the king's body away for a simple Christian burial in the choir of their church in the Friary Complex. Well, that's the location, everyone. Very simple, isn't it? Very, very simple. Over and out. <laughs>